How's it going guys? Stefan here. Welcome back for another video. In today's video I'm going to show you how to use a green screen uh, on Final Cut Pro. So without further ado let's start the video. Uh, the first thing that you need is going to be a green screen. As you can see behind me I have a green screen uh, and uh, I'm going to show you how to do that on your Final Cut Pro. So just follow my steps uh, and it's very easy and uh, it's very cool you can do a lot of stuff you can put pictures videos so it's very very easy so let's go to the computer and let me show you how to do that okay so let's open the final cut pro 10 so we're gonna get a video this is my previous video from yesterday let's drop it to the timeline perfect let me adjust the sound because we don't want the sound for now okay as you can see the video is here we are behind the green screen let me give you a good look here make sure that it's nice there's no edges, obviously it is a small hole, but I think it's not going to be a problem on the video I'm going to show you. Um, you can buy different uh, green screen from different companies, make sure that you have the right size, uh, 3 feet, 4 feet, depends how long uh, you want it to be. In my case, I think this is perfect, make sure that you are in the... Uh, your focus on that. Make sure that you, you don't go outside from the green screen, otherwise it's gonna be a noisy. Okay, and now what we have to do is uh, to look for the right uh, video effect. Um, so let's go on the right side. As you can see here, we have our transitions, but we don't need the transitions effects. We're gonna go to the this bit here. Just follow my curse, my mouse. So install it effects. So in, on the install it effects, we're gonna look for on the search type kilo echo keyring as you can see here. So we need this effect, this video effect. So we're gonna take this video effect and we're gonna drop it on our video. As you can see here now. The background is already black, so we're gonna add our background. In, in that case, I don't have a picture, so I'm gonna get something from, um, let me see, from generators. So your titles are here, but you have a generators as well. This is very helpful if you're looking for a nice, cool background, so you can put a picture, video, whatever you prefer, just be creative. So in that case, I'm going to take um, this blue background. I'm going to drop it here. And voila, as you can see, now my background is blue, which is pretty, pretty cool. And one more last thing that I'm going to show you the settings here. So basically, as you can see, on the video that I have here is not perfect the colors are not perfect as you can see this should be blue here how to fix all the colors on your picture here on yourself so basically click on your video on the top and now on the right side we have settings we can play with these settings but be careful but it's good to see what's going on um, but yeah, be creative, be careful, I mean, play with these settings, make sure you don't <laughs> do anything wrong, but yeah, just play with these settings. So to fix this, it's very simple, as you can see here, split level, so just drag that to the left. And as you can see now, everything is much perfect, as you can see, everything is good now here, everything is nice, balance, all the colors are good, and this here on the top is just to remove the green screen if you want to but we don't want to and yes that's it pretty much as we can see very easy simple easy to fix that if you want background for your video 
you can put a picture if you're tiring to always put background or let's say um, you don't have a studio at home uh, and this is very helpful for studio if you don't have a studio place to film you just need a good green screen good um, uh, light as well and yeah that's it pretty much you can put video picture be creative uh, if this video is helpful make sure you subscribe and like the video uh, my name is Stefan and I'm going to see you in my next video